Hey everyone, welcome to another edition of Got Lex. It is Tuesday today, and that normally means that I should be out riding the uh, Chrono Cup. But I've been feeling uh, weird lately because all through the last week I felt like there was something, uh, I was ill or, or some kind. And um, I just couldn't seem to get my head around it. I was out riding with um, some, fr uh, some of the guys from the club, as mentioned in another video. And I was uh, I was uh, struggling just breathing and hanging on with them and kept feeling like I had like a lump in my throat that I couldn't release by coughing and my stomach's been upset and all that stuff. It's been the weirdest uh, spring and winter <laughs> of my life because I haven't really been ill. I've been ill a couple of times but it's been nothing like previously when where I've been like really ill. Um, but this year it's just it feels like the illness this time has just been just below the surface, not really peaking at any point. So, and I felt like I've been through that for the last week as well because I've just had a weird uh, relationship with my stomach uh, and feeling a bit under the weather, basically. So hopefully that will clear off uh, by now. So no writing for me today. I decided to, to take the day off also because I was up really, really early, so I'm quite tired today. And uh, tomorrow I'm heading off to uh, to Aarhus and uh, visit uh, Villafit and do uh, a short interview with them or with Thomas. So no riding today, no riding tomorrow, and then hopefully I'll be on the bike again uh, Thursday and uh, be able to do some training for the remainder of the week because I need it. I really need to get out training. So what's new? Well, last week or the week before that, I think it was, I ordered new socks. I really like wearing bright colored socks and not just wearing uh, white socks. Um, I have some black socks and I never wear them because I don't think that you should be riding black socks. I don't care if you're riding for Quick Step or uh, Team Sky or anything like that. Black socks with cycling is a no-go. I know it's a lot easier when you're out in the rain and don't ruin your socks, but come on white socks or colored socks. But anyway, I got an email from Morvelo uh, a couple of weeks ago and uh, they were releasing, I actually don't know if they were releasing them once again or they had them uh, all the time. But these so socks, as you can see, they're quite uh, pink, bright colored and uh, they actually have a saying on them. You can't probably read that, but it basically says, fuck cancer. I bought two pairs because why not? Um, all the proceedings from uh, the sale goes to cancer re research in the U uh, UK. And they made the socks for a friend of them who died last year, I think it was, of cancer. So all the proceedings from the sale of these socks go directly to the cancer research. I have, think they have like three different uh, uh, centers that they send the, uh, the money to. So all in all... Uh, buying socks for a good cause, basically. Um, as I mentioned, I bought two pairs and I rode one of them uh, this Sunday. They feel great. This, these are my first Morvillo socks. They actually feel quite nice. They're a bit thicker than normal, um, quite stretchy as well, but they look great. I hope they'll, they'll last. So if you haven't bought them already, make sure to go to Morvillo. And by the way, I'm not sponsored in any way by Morvillo. I don't get discounts uh, other than you guys do. Um, I just think that uh, some of the things that they do are pretty awesome. So go to the Movelo side. There's a, they are about uh, 10 pounds uh, for a pair of socks. And as I mentioned, it all goes to uh, fighting cancer. So no reason not to buy them, basically, unless you're already full stacked on socks. Uh, I guess they would go with a, a good pair of jeans as well, or a good pair of shorts if you wanted that. Just wear them as your normal attire. Um, if you have fat calves like me, they look uh, look a bit different when you pull them up. <laughs> but um, that's how it goes. They, they feel great and they're all in good cost. So what else is new? Well, not really uh, that much. Um, the weather is still pretty... It, it seems as if summer is finally arriving. Um, but today it's just been cloudy all day, a bit windy. And... Uh, They've been talking about rain all day, but it hasn't really been raining here at least. 
So there's actually no real excuse for not going out today because it's actually dry and all that. So for all those guys who participated in the Chrono Cup, I wish you a good ride. And for all of you other guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, watch the other videos, and I'll see you out there. And as I mentioned, uh, tomorrow I'll be interviewing uh, Thomas from VeloFit. Um, I was actually planning on writing them because they have like a, a, a training session afterwards uh, about five o'clock. Uh, but since I have to uh, go with the ferry home and all that, I'll be home way too late. So instead I'm just uh, doing the interview and having my shoes fitted and then I'll be on my way home. And hopefully that'll uh, um, result in that you will see this uh, or the, the other video uh, tomorrow night, hopefully. So thanks for watching once again. Bye.